We do have a lot of customers that have, like we're doing inside, we do windows and, and their deck's pretty beat up. It's almost unsafe to stay on top of, right? And they're like, hey, I just don't have the money today to rebuild a brand new deck. So we do talk to them, hey, we do offer financing. We could look at things you do to get a new deck. Or there are sometimes homeowners where it's just the top deck boards that are bad and the rest of it's sound and structural. And so we do do deck refacing, meaning we take off the existing boards, we swap out any kind of rotted boards on the on the joist or frame, we reframe it, we seal it, we make sure it's, uh, it's extremely durable, it's water resistant, it's built to code. And then we basically go over the top with a new composite deck that's not gonna have any maintenance issues. That's a really good solution for a lot of homeowners, especially where decks are ground level. Unfortunately, if we're doing decks that are eight to 20 feet off the ground, normally the existing structure doesn't meet code and it's not built very well. And at that point, we really can't just reface the top of the deck because the deck itself is built structure and sound non safe. And so if you have a deck zero to 30 inches off the ground, refacing just the top, removing your old cedar, going back with the composite, reface and refresh, is a fantastic solution. If your deck is eight to 20 feet off the ground, unfortunately, overwhelmingly likely, your frame's actually not sound, it's not built correctly, you have gaps that are on safe. And I know it might not be rotting, but like, it's kind of a ticking time bomb. And so unfortunately for those homeowners, you're probably gonna have to look at getting a brand new deck. A lot of homeowners ask about maintenance of decks. And the beauty is if you're getting a new composite deck or a new PVC deck, there's very little to no maintenance. You might wanna power wash it, once or twice a season, but you don't have to. If you have an old wood deck, you probably want to look at power washing and seeing every two or three years, which is a huge reason why people don't want to go with wood. So wood is cheaper today than a composite deck is, but you're gonna, one, the life cycle on a wood deck is probably 20 years and a composite's 40, but every three years, you're gonna to have to spend money and time keeping the wood deck up to speed, replacing boards, power washing, scraping, staining, and so when you really factor in a total cost over 25 years, PVC and composite decks are probably actually cheaper. It's all the time and all the maintenance, all the replacing. Most people find there's better ways to spend their time on a Saturday in the fall or the summer.